Following a developing story, at least 30 homes have now been destroyed by Hawaii's Kilauea volcano. Scientists say there is no indication the eruptions are slowing down. Authorities have evacuated more than 1,700 people, many of whom are terrified they will never go home again. CBS 4 John Shumo has the latest. From the air, you can watch the lava flows in Hawaii's Leilani Estates ignite the houses and then slowly consume them. Amber Makuakane is among dozens who watch videos of their homes disappear. My son asks, Mommy, can we go home? More than 1,700 people have been evacuated since hundreds of earthquakes started rocking the Big Island last week, and at least 11 volcanic fissures spontaneously opened up. Some lava flows are creeping through neighborhoods. Some are at a slow boil, others spewing 200 feet into the air. It's, it's like a Goliath, or like, or like a roaring jet engine. Letting people eat down to Miley Street only. Get your belongings and get back out. Some families have been allowed back in, cramming as many clothes and keepsakes that can fit into their cars. If we get to go a second load, then we'll uh, pick things that maybe would make our life more comfortable. But right now, we're living out of a backpack. Many evacuated residents are frustrated by the long lines to get back into their homes, but there's a concern lava will cover more roads and trap people inside. The prognosis is for this to continue. We see no slowdown in activity. Lava has spread nearly 400,000 square feet surrounding the most active fissure. John Shumo, CBS News, New York.